Over the past year, I've posted onto YouTube pretty much every Tuesday here on the channel. But you may have noticed a lack of videos over the past month. So I wanted to put a video up today to talk about why and what's happened as a result. I've had a major life event happen over the past month, which has meant that time has been at a premium. Aside from the factor of time, it's a pretty stressful part of my life. So honestly, I didn't really have the headspace either to focus on content creation and being here on YouTube. However, a few weeks later, and after having had a week off for pure relaxation, it's time to jump back in the saddle, and I've got some great things to share with you in the upcoming weeks. On top of all of that, as a band, Old and R, we've got relatively quite a lot going on at the moment. We released a reworked version of our last EP, we recently shot a music video for a new track and an upcoming release. We've been finishing mixes, speaking to mastering engineers, and finalizing artwork for upcoming releases in 2022. So on reflection, what have the repercussions been both personally and for here on YouTube of me posting a lot less in the past month or so? We're told that the algorithm needs consistency, and that in turn can create a built-in anxiety to us. This feeling that we have to churn out content no matter what. When I look at the data, Yet, the past month has clearly seen a dip in engagement and view time on the channel. But honestly, that's fine. I expect it. Within myself, well, I feel great. It's been nice to get outside a lot more instead of being hunched over gear, filming and editing videos non-stop. It's been lovely to catch up with friends and family and obviously complete something that has been ongoing for the last three years, what with everything that's been happening in the world. In terms of what's next here on the channel, we've got loads of new gear, some more tutorials, some new guest appearances and different styles of video that I want to try out. Also, I've never really been the guitar guy. I actually prefer generally gear and effects more than guitars, but we are going to be showcasing a lot more guitar specific stuff here on the channel, as well as some of the synth stuff that we've dabbled with recently. So thank you for watching, let's enjoy the journey and be sure to check in each week for new videos here on the channel. And if you want over on our Instagram page for more regular short content, hit the subscribe button and I'll see you next week.